You are listening to Learn Thai g l i c k l o y podcast, where learning Thai is as easy as peeling a banana. สวัสดีค่ะ Hi everyone, welcome back again, นะคะ to the Learn Thai Click Learn Podcast, where you learn Thai as easy as peeling a banana. And today you are with me again, Cruz. Today, ค่ะ I would like to introduce you 10 common personality of Thai people, and they will be categorized into two groups, which is the first group, good personalities, and the second one, not so good personalities. Well, the reason that I decided to make a podcast about this topic it is because I would like to introduce you more about you know Thai people's personality and behavior, so you can understand us much more. Nah, before we start with this topic, I would like to introduce you one word, the key word, the word n i s a i n i s a i Ah, and it's spelled like n o n u s a r i นิสอเสือไม่หันอากาศยอยักษ์ใสนิสัยค่ะนิสัย means habit or some kind of personality or behavior you can also say นิสัยดี which means like good habit or like you know good personality good nature or นิสัยไม่ดี like you're bad person let's just say like that let's start with the first value that is considered good of Thai people First one, ความกตัญญูอ่าความกตัญญู So the word กตัญญู in English is being grateful, being thankful. Ah, ความกตัญญู When you put the word ความ in front, now as a prefix, it's turned the word to be now, right? So กตัญญู means grateful. And ความกตัญญู therefore mean gratefulness or thankfulness. Ah, as you can see, Thai people are very very close to the family. Once they know how to make money, they send money back home. They send money to their parents. They treat their parents very very well. And not only to our parents, but for anyone that have helped us before, we must give back for what we received. Ah. So this is the first value of good habit of Thai people. กตัญญูค่ะก็ไก่ต่อเต่าไม่หันหน้ากาดยอหญิงยอหญิงสระอูกตัญญู The next value or personality of Thai people is มีน้ำใจ Well, if you translate it word by word, it would be to have hard water, and you will be like. What is that? Hard water. The word น้ำใจค่ะน้ำใจ is not hard water, but more like a hospitality or kindness. So มีน้ำใจ means to have hospitality or kindness. This is also why many people like Thai people. Um, it is because Thai people not only smile a lot, but also very very helpful. You can see very easily on BTS or on the bus if. That is like a pregnant woman or a senior lady or senior man standing. There will be somebody give a seat to the to the senior people or to the pregnant woman or kids. So this is the value that I think it's like the charm of Thai people. n a m i n a m Thai as being kind, have kindness. Next one, ka. เกรงใจ The word เกรงใจ has no straight translation in English, but it's more like being thoughtful, being considerate. You are เกรงใจนะคะ when somebody have to take effort to do something for you, and you feel like oh no, I'm considerate. Like, hey, you don't have to do this for me. I feel เกรงใจ for you to do this for me. Please don't. Like, let's say, if You know, I have to walk home. My home is like 10 minutes walk from the office, and then my boss like saw me and like, "Hey, smoke, come jump on my car. I drive you home. It's just there." And I was like, "ไม่เป็นไรค่ะ No worries. เกรงใจ Ah, so this is เกรงใจนะคะ And the word เกรงใจนะคะ It's spelled 
ซาราเอกอไก่รอเรืององูเกรง because it's a cluster กอไก่ and รอเรือเกรงใจสระไอไม่ม้วน and จอจาด now come to the fourth value ah this one is on น้อมถ่อมตน oh my god so long well just say on น้อม I think on น้อม is already good enough and the word on น้อม is spelled อออนอไม่เอกนะคะ so ออ่างอ่างนอหนูไม่เอก on and the word น้อมนะคะนอหนูออมอมาไม่โถน้อม the word on น้อม mean docile or being humble this is also a core value that Thai people are considered as polite people let's say you're not breaking around so if somebody is above your status in term of age Position, you will be on norm. You will be humble. You will be like easy to follow. Ah, so this is on norm, นะคะ And the last one of the good Thai values or good Thai habits, a personality. s a b a i s a b a i s a b a i s a b a i Ah, s a b a i s a b a i meaning like chill, easy. Whatever, it's okay. This is what Thai people like to say. It's okay, na. It's okay. Ah, no worry, no problem, no problem. <laughs> Because Thai people are so chill. Whatever that went wrong, we would just say it. Maybe like, sabai sabai. Oh, it maybe like okay, die. You know. So this sabai sabai is also one of. The values that I really appreciate because I feel like, hey, that's super cool. Like, you know, you're so chill. However, s a b a i s a b a i could also be considered as something not good because it's too s a b a i s a b a i right? And that's why we're gonna talk about not so good personality or habits of Thai people. Uh, another five habits. Start from the first one, นะคะงมง่าย Might be hard to pronounce. งมง่ายงมงองูมอมานะคะงออกมองมแอนง่ายนะคะงองูสระอายอยักงออายอง่ายงมง่ายแอนงมง่าย in this case related to believe like we strongly believe in something especially superstitious thing like ghost god spirit. Um, lack, karma, and something like this. นะคะงมงาย Next one ค่ะไม่ตรงเวลา <laughs> Thai time ค่ะไม่ not right. ตรง is like straight, strict. เวลา is time, like not strict to time. ไม่ตรงเวลา The normal time will come maybe 10 minutes late or 15 minutes late. But some people might come even. Half an hour later than the mutually agreed time, n a And this is something I feel like. Yes, it's a by by, n a Thai people will say, "Oh, it's okay, maybe like a by by." But for some foreigners, or for even for some Thai people that quite like stick to time, it's bad, <laughs> right? ถ้าคุณไม่ตรงเวลาคุณมาสายเนี่ยคนอื่นต้องรอนะอ่า if you don't stick to time if you come late มาสายคนอื่นต้องรอ other people have to wait and that's not good the next not so good value is เล่นพักเล่นพวก well เล่น is to play but in this case it not mean like to play something พักแอนพวก means like friendships Alliance. So we play with alliance. Like we give special privilege to people that we know. It's good. I mean, in terms of if if you know people, that would be good, right? It's against justice. It's against equality. Nah. So Len Park Len p u a You will see many times Thai people are very like they have a very strong friendship. Or relationship with some people, and they're very, very stick to them, and they very value this friendship. And whatever happen, they will prioritize these people first. But when it come with some kind of politics or some kind of business, it's turned to be corruption. It turned to be you know inequality or injustice. 
Now come to the next one, ค่ะ almost the last one. This is also a behavior that I think you would agree with me, and it's big thing. This one is called กลัวเสียหน้า g l u a is being afraid of something, being fearful of something. g l u a ฉันกลัว I am afraid. นะ afraid of. You don't need any word to say of. Just say g l u a as afraid of. เสียหน้า s e a is broken. หน้า in this case mean face. So losing face. I think Thai people very have a big ego, even myself, and. If we put effort of doing something, and some people or somebody come in and say like, don't really appreciate us, or say something that make us feel like lose face, it's a big thing. Seriously, it's a big thing. So you have to be very, very careful with this. Don't make anyone lose their face. For example, if you are invited to a party, your friend promised you. That they will bring you like to a very great party with many good connections, and when you're there, you're like, oh, this is not as what I have expected. And then I speak it out loud, like, hey, ที่นี่ไม่ดีเลยอ่ะ Here is not so good. Like you told me that you're gonna bring me great people, but look at these people, not so great in front of many people, and then your friend lose his face or her face. This is a big thing. Your friend will get so angry if somebody see na lose face na. They will really remember it. <laughs> they will think about it a lot. So don't do that. Now come to the last value na, which is om kom. Like om means like om mean like not straight, not straightforward. You go around. You want to say something, but you say other thing. As you know, Thai people say many nice words. They might think like that, or they're afraid of they're gonna hurt you. So that's why they're not straightforward and they um. When it's issue or problem, they will be like, "Hey, it's not a problem. It's very good, but it's not okay." Sometimes, but they just don't dare to say it. So working with Thai, you have to really make them feel comfortable. For example, let's say if you ask them, "Hey, is there any problem with this time? Maybe you have appointment during this time. Can we make a meeting? You let me know if it's not possible." Thai people will be die, 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 like can as always. But um, you have to make them feel comfortable. Like, "Oi, ไม่เป็นไรนะแบบ it's okay." If um, ถ้าไม่ว่างเนี่ยตอนไหนก็ได้ If it's not now, any time is good. You have to make them feeling like, "Oh, it's fine not to agree with you." Being calm, calm with people is also part of the Thai culture. And how was it? I think you have some certain values that you agree with, and some certain values that you don't agree, or you have other additional values that you want to add on. Feel free to comment below or drop your email at krusmuk at banana thai school dot com if you have. Any ideas to share with me, or any question, or if you need any personal assistance for me, how to deal with some certain Thai behavior, please feel free to contact me. And that's it for today with the ten values. Let me repeat quickly. First one, กตังยู being thankful, มีน้ำใจ have hospitality or being kind. เกรงใจ is being considerate. อ่อนน้อมถ่อมตน means being humble. สบายสบาย it's like being chill, being easy. Now come to the next five, which is you know which are not really considered as good things. First one, งมง่าย strongly believe in something that it doesn't really make sense or provable. ไม่ตรงต่อเวลา not stick to time or like not be on time. Next one, l e n p a k p u a k meaning that giving priority to your friends, like give privilege to benefit your friends. g l u a s i a n a being afraid of losing face. Oh, this is very important to know, na. And last one, ka om kom, mai trong pai trong ma, like you are going around, not straightforward, na. So that's it for the ten common Thai values or personalities that you should know in order to deal with Thai people happily and easily. 
And that's it for today. I hope you enjoy my podcast. I'm very happy that I could make this topic happen to, you know, like bridge the culture difference from your side and Thai people's side. So that's it for today. I hope to see you in the next episode now with Learn Thai Click Loi Podcast. I am k r u s m o k Your Thai teacher from Banana Thai. If you are interested in learning Thai, take a look at my website, w o r l d w i d e w e b b a n a n a t h a i s c h o o l c o m or just contact me via email. See you later. Music.